hello everyone welcome to another video in this video i will tell you how you can create a alternate key which can be used as a alternate option to define a row uniquely without using gyd and how we can restrict uh, users uh, to create duplicate records uh, using the same key right so why we use alternate key instead of using gyd we can represent another key with combination of one field or multiple fields to represent as a unique key okay so let us create a key so uh, i have an entity called a certification certificate master i have navigated to keys and created a new queue new key and when the new key is created i have associated given a name name key just a display name of the alternate key and it will create a schema name which is your uh, prefix and the schema name and the name of the key, uh, key then i have associated name field to represent as unique key that means if someone will try to create another record with same name it will it will uh, identified as a duplicate record right so here gyd will not be the primary key of the table will not be associated or uh, included whether the name field will be behave as a will behave as a primary key now let us go and create a uh, uh, record with same name let's say this is a record certificate one and this is the name field of this record so i want to create another uh, record with same name now if you save it it will automatically allow uh, automatically display message that a record that has an attribute value name already exists the entity key name key so this is the alternate key we have created so it is showing a message that the entity key name key requires that this set of attributes contains unique value now here it is restricting creating duplicate records so this is the benefit of using alternate key uh, if you don't want to uh, configure any uh, duplicate detection rules so you can also do it in alternate key so i hope you understand how it works you can also combine multiple fields while creating uh, alternate keys. Thanks everyone.